Hello everyone this is Ultimate Public Entertainment. This random person at Starbucks, who seems to be off the clock, disapproved the purchase of a venti cup to a customer. Watch this. So is that the grand? So I can't. You say, you're saying I can't. I can't. I can't no, buy a venti cup. No, we, we only have like that left for a venti cup, so we need to save them for our drinks. So, okay, so, so we do have it. So okay, I'll drink. just buy the drink and then can he toss out the drink? I'll pay for the drink. Yeah, that's fine if you want to do that. It's just we can't just. All right, I know. I, I, I've been at plenty of locations. They all, they all do that, and they've never said anything like that yeah. ever. Well, even, even if you don't sell it, that's fine. Yeah. Because my friend, she's corporate. She works out of this, the safety one. She's corporate. Yeah. So I'll just have a little chat with her and ask her about because I know for yeah, a fact. Yeah, definitely go chat with her about yeah. it because I can do this a long time. I know. I don't know what happened. You know. But we I have just, plenty of granny cups. We just have a few minutes there. No I worries. just reset my password. What was your name? What do you do you work here? I'm not working right now. But do you work here? I'm not gonna talk to you. I huh? don't like to be filmed. No, I'm just letting, I'm just letting you know because that's out of out of the blue. You don't want to tell me something. I don't. And you're not on the clock. Yeah, I'm just. So you're you you're know. telling me something. You're not even on the clock. You're just interrupting. So you're a regular customer, right? You don't even work. You're not even on the clock, and you're just over oh, here telling me about a free venti cup. No, I, I, like I said, I have money. I can pay for it. I just want a venti cup. That's it. You're not even on the clock, and you're over here bothering me. You're just coming out of nowhere. You're the one who interrupted. I was talking to him. I was letting you know we have plenty of grande cups. I was talking to him and asking for a venti cup, and he was going to grab me until you said something. You're not even on the clock. Well, I'm not even going to talk to you anymore. There you go. Don't you love how she said she is off the clock, but she had a huge opinion regarding the issue. Also, let me know in the comment section if you're able to get a free venti cup at your local starbucks store a guy at a local mcdonald's restaurant had the cops called on him for loitering watch this so we got a 30 minute loitering she told me that originally so then i went up and i got myself a drink you have to get food you not know right. so i made a purchase i'm an actual customer of mcdonald's okay. now no. and i'm not allowed to stay for what reason? Because we have a lo no loitering. So it's loitering since I got a drink and I'm hanging out, drinking my drink. All right, I'll give you 15 more minutes, but then you got to go. Then can I have my money back for the drink since I'm not even allowed to have it in the store? I'm not even allowed to have my own drink that I paid for in the store at the store. I told you the signs here. You know how crazy that sounds? Like, I get it. Like, if I was, like, disturbing people here or, like, you know, But that we have no issue. place for the customers to sit when you're... What about this table, that table, that table, that table, that table, that table? There's, like, 15 open tables. I'm not... Like, I'm not talking to you. I'm actually just talking to her. So, I don't know what is wrong with you. Like, why she has such an attitude. If she was, like, respectful when she came over the first time and they just talked to me, it'd be so different. The problem is, we have too many people coming in and sit for hours on end. That means yeah. nobody wants to come and sit. I am preventing customers from wanting to sit in McDonald's, is what you're saying. But if we get full and you're sitting still if you, sitting If in, there was a lot of people here, I would be out. There's no, there's nobody here. It's so, it's, this is like... But you understand, you right? You can't order in other people's parking lots, can you? I'm not. I'm not in your parking lot. I'm in your store, and I bought a drink. Now, I'm gonna give you 30 more minutes, and you got to go. Okay. So what happens at minute 29 if I go buy a, a small French fry? How much more time does that allow me to be in your store? I'm not arguing. I'm not arguing. I'm just asking you a question. If you're the supervisor, I'd expect well, you to not ask. Oh, well, ask for the supervisor. Oh well. I don't know what to tell you then. Guess what? I'm not talking to you. I was talking to her. So you can go be cranky somewhere else. Wow. He didn't have to you say been that so though. Cranky all day. I don't understand. Get out or I call the cops. For what? So now she's gonna call the cops on me. You were just fine. They're old, not old. I know. I don't understand. I'm not bothering a single person in here. The cops came later and told the guy that they had called in for a disorderly customer. No charges were filed because he had already been kicked out of the restaurant. This guy called the cops on a person that was trying to promote his business in his neighborhood. He said 
They look suspicious. Watch this. Is there any reason you would like us to leave? Yeah, because you're suspicious. We're suspicious? How are we suspicious? Me and my little brother are wearing normal clothes. He says we're suspicious because I'm out here trying to pro promote my detailing business. And that makes me quote unquote suspicious. The address on Glybone, I can give you one right now. Hold on a second, ma'am. I'll give you one 8647 Glybone Court. Yes, under the flag, they parked far away under the flag of uh, basically doing car detailing, suspicious activities, and uh, the tag number is IY91TT. It's a Ford GT, been very, very defensive, very obnoxious, and now he's videotaping me. That's an in, yeah, India Yankee 91 Tom Tom, yes. Okay, look at Now, now we have to wait for the police, because... Yeah. If it's not, they're gonna try to say that we did something wrong. When he pulled up all aggressively, blue, almost hit the GT. trunk right in front of him and almost swerved right here in the middle of the road. But apparently we're suspicious. And he just drove over here all aggressively, yes, yeah. approached us with an yes, attitude. Yes, we have no soliciting. He spoke, to, been nothing. Defensive. He's spoke been to him with nothing but respect. Yeah. It's okay, I got video okay. for all of it. Uh, yeah, he's got video. Uh, but with tattoos, he has a jasmine tattoo on his uh, right hand side. He's oh, we'll be here. We'll be here. Okay. We'll be he here when they pull up. We'll be here. We'll be, yeah, we'll be so right here when now, they pull up. And we do have uh, we do have a sign: no soliciting, no trespassing. We haven't trespassed. Yeah. No, we haven't trespassed. He has a white shirt and a brown and a brown uh, uh, khaki shorts. These are green. And a second one. Has These are green. Shorts and a black. Shirt. These are green. Tell them they're green. Okay. And you would have zero business here, by the way. Tell them they're green. Okay. Aggressive, obnoxious, he doesn't want Please to step yeah. away from my car, sir. I feel yeah. very unsafe. Yeah. Please step away from my car, sir. And he said he... he I feel very unsafe. He, Please he step said, away from my yeah. car. Anyways, man, that's about it. Please step away from my car, sir. I feel very unsafe. Sorry, say again, man. Oh, wow. Yeah. No, I am... Uh, I am uh, too hard to talk after that. Mind you, this man's house is all the way down there. And yeah. He drove all yeah, the way down here. here. He will be here. We are very. We have a neighborhood watch, and we are very active. We have three board members already have monitored this person, and uh, they called us. They monitored. They monitored him from somewhere else. Mm -hmm. Now, yeah, we're not exactly. I will not. I will not waste myself with this box. I'm heading back to the house. Wait for the police. The guy that allegedly looked suspicious waited for the police, but they never showed. They ended up leaving the neighborhood. A customer at a local CVS pharmacy asked the manager for the bathroom for her child, and this happened. I like your name. Stop being disgusting with people so you don't get bothered. That's what, yeah, because you said racist, ugly things to me. And you say you're the manager. I still want your name. I think the way the lady and her child were treated by the manager was wrong. On the other hand, 
videotaping the guy while he was at work was also wrong. I believe she should file a formal complaint. What do you think? I don't understand why some neighbors cannot live at peace with each other. Watch this. I don't care. I don't care. Okay. I tried to offer you a copy okay, of our HOA yeah, rules. So yeah, sure. That's our HOA rules. No, you, you told me it's your rules. No, I did not. I said I have a copy of the okay. rules. Okay. All right. You know what, Adrian? Okay. You know what? If you keep pushing me, I'm going to tell you to move your car or I'm going to tow it. Okay, tow it. Really? No, don't. Challenge accepted. Do it. Do it, dude. Do it. You, 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 do it. Tow it. You think that, that when you car bought that house, your house? You think that when you bought that house, you dude, bought mine? Is, listen, this is the first time we parked there because of obvious situation because we just one moved. Thing. Oh, no, you weren't telling. You weren't talking. You were yelling. You oh came there all God. up in our business. All I was going to yeah, try like, to do. Yeah, do it, do. tow it, tow it. Can you just be quiet for tow one it. minute? For one minute. Oh, can so you now just... you want me to be quiet. Okay, we're go done. ahead. We're done. Go ahead. Come on, we're done. This isn't working. I was okay. trying to talk to you. Yeah, your wife is actually reasonable. You're right. Well, why you... do you got to call her names? All I was trying to do was say, hey, all I wanted to tell you was you can park there today, but I need that spot for tomorrow. That's all I was going to say. That's and not what I heard. And then you come up That's with saying, I, I don't care what you heard. And then you start saying, I got an attitude. You have to have permission to park in front of my place. HOA rules, not my That's rules. That's not in front of your place. That please. is my front of my house. It actually is. The property line ends right there. It is. By There's the a marker hydrant, in right. the curb that says. I don't that understand. Is that that is spot is vacant now. I don't understand why you're throwing a big deal. What is spot that? Is you needed some excitement what spot for is your vacant? Saturday. What spot is vacant? What spot? There's what? you I don't can park need. There? You cook and park in three feet. So what? How? Do, why does it bother you? Because right because now it moving. doesn't. We actually have somebody that lives in our. It does not right now. So mm -hmm. they come home and they park there. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you, I tow need it. Do it. Tow it. I still want you to tow my car. Do it. Tow it. That's you know, you're a see. wonderful neighbor. She's trying to ask. Oh, it's yeah. It's, I'm well, so are, happy you're our neighbor too. You talk about us being a Karen. Are you serious? No, you're a Ken. No. You call me. See now, you're calling me names. If anybody's mm -hmm. acting like a Karen, mm -hmm. it's you. I was going to tell you, you're oh, cool good. to park there without me asking you, without okay. asking my permission. Okay, well, I wish you would actually say that because that's not what I heard. You didn't give me and a then chance. You come here with. No, you okay. stuck a phone in my face and said, yeah, I'm filming you. Yeah, because you're out there yelling at my husband. So, what am I supposed to do? Uh, if you read your rules, you would at least have had to uh, ask me, oh, and okay. I'd have said, sure, I'm okay. okay with that. You can get it, sweetie. It's because you're so nice. Let's go. Okay, good. Tell it though. Why don't you have your husband come and talk to me? I don't. I don't need a man to to handle it. Well, I don't need a woman to sit here and make me feel like I'm All a right. piece of crap either. All right. That Tom. is my property. You bought that place. That's yours. Exactly. That's my house. That's mine. Okay. That is not yours. Okay. I'm, I never said it was no, mine. You I don't think want you it. Did. You said I can park there anytime I want. You said that's common yep, property. Yeah, because we're moving. Yep. Let's yeah, go. I'm going to play this at the HOA meeting. I don't care who you play okay. it for. Okay. I have a right to have my own house. I never said you didn't. Well, why you act like you have a right to park in front of my house whenever you want? <laughs> Are you, th you think that's funny? I do think it's funny. The fact that it bothers you to the core, I think it's really funny. What bothers me and to the core sad. is it's the person sad. who thinks that they can just run all over me and, and mm -hmm. it's okay. because it's okay How do we run all over you? Are you kids in my yard? Are you kidding? That's not your yard. That's, That's not the, my the yard. Are oh, you out get angry. Please get angrier. Yes, do it. Do Are it. you out of my mind? You that is not my yard. Who oh is? yeah, put your hand on the hip and get oh, angry. You told my car, God. come on. Oh yeah, this is gonna be good. This is our yard. Did I touch you? Am I close to you? No. No, I'm not. but you're but like you know, you're, you're telling me that's not my yard? That's not That's yard. not my yard. Are you out of your oh, mind? I'm calling the police and I'm showing them this video. Call them. Call the police. I'm not even threatening you. I'm not near you. Nope, you're just being that a is my you're just being yard. A that is my yard, not your yard. Okay. Okay. Yeah, you think that's funny? Yep, I actually do. When are you going to tell my car? Okay. Yikes. This guy was so upset that his neighbor parked in front of his house. That was unbelievable. Karen versus Karen, pulling out their phones and recording each other. Take a look. Hold on, we're in Telemundo over here. 
pizza del mundo. Yeah, we're we're all different races, by the way. Oh, oh. Wow, Karen is claiming the public street has her property. What do you think? When Karen uses 911 as a threat, take a look at this. Back at you. Hi. Yeah. That's your camera. Yeah, that is my camera, and I'm calling 911 right now. And you're making miss my appointment, my doctor's appointment. You're making I yourself do miss apologize. it. Apologize. Either you you're, you're making yourself miss it. No, you didn't have to do the verbal F you and call me a b Did you? Did you? Hey, I'm pulling over did where you? I live. Did you? Then apologize and we let it go. Or you want to go and I press charges. Because look, I am a disabled and I have problems. And I am missing my appointment because of you. And you're paying for my b co payment. I'm not kidding. You can video all you want. But you cut me off and you did. Whatever you did. Go ahead. The camera, but look it, I'm missing my appointment, Mister. All right, nine one one. This is enough. You're videoing me, and go and um, do whatever you want. All right, here we go. Sorry. I will move my car to stop traffic. If you need, I got your paper. If you watch this video to the end, please do not forget to indicate in the comment section. Good job, Karen. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.